Okay guys, what we're looking at here is a modified version of the cook ridge. One to help strengthen our glutes and then also to help work on that hip extension range of motion um, and to make sure that we're not arching the back and compensating. So what we'll do is we'll lay on our back here. We're gonna have, we're working with this leg. So this opposite knee right here, you're gonna take it and pull it as far up on the chest as possible. What this is going to do is going to help lock out the lumbar spine. So the lumbar spine is not going to be able to arch to compensate. And all the motion is going to be coming from your hip. It's also going to get you a better stretch on your hip flexor right here. So I'm going to hold here. Once again, bring it all the way to the chest. And bridge up. Keep that knee pulled towards your chest. And then down. I like to hold at the top for about three seconds or so. So I'm going to pull in. Bridge up. One, two, three. And down. Really make sure you're squeezing that glute the whole entire time, okay? If you feel your hamstrings starting to cramp or anything, try lifting up the toes a little bit and more driving through the heel. We'll show one example of that real quick. So pull here, toes up, drive through the heel, and down. Give that guys a try, especially if you usually have back pain with bridges, that's a perfect one for you. So give it a shot.